Did you know that this travel neck pillow is making over $1.1 million per month on Amazon? But the golden question is, what is the actual profit? And in today's video, I'm gonna help you better understand Amazon FBA fees and what is your true profit margin. Let's get into it. Okay, so to better understand Amazon FBA fees, we're gonna break down the profit on this neck pillow. As we can see, it is doing over $1.1 million every single month in revenue. Now that's revenue, that's not profit. I'm gonna explain and break down the difference. Then I'm gonna show you guys how you can break down and understand your true profit margin in inside your Amazon FBA business. So right here, 1.1 million a month. And then right here, it's doing 50,000 sales every single month. What we're gonna do is we're gonna copy this ASIN. So I'm gonna copy this, and you're gonna go to Google and type in Amazon FBA fee calculator. And it will pull up this revenue calculator inside Amazon. You can either sign into your Amazon account or you can continue as guest. And then it will pull up and break down the fulfillment fees for this particular product. So right here, we have Amazon fees to fulfill this item. It's gonna be 429. Then you're gonna have a fulfillment cost of 540, then you're gonna have storage fees. So there are different fees to sell on Amazon. And so many people get worked up and stressed of, oh, they're taking so much of my profit and I can't be profitable. But that's not true because the reality is, is if you didn't have the Amazon marketplace, if you didn't have access to their customers, their fulfillment centers, their resources, you wouldn't be able to grow and scale your business to the level that you want because you have to go out, find your own customers, pay for traffic, pay for fulfillment, pay for employees, the list goes on. So these fees are well worth it. Right here, we'll break down the actual profit. Once we understand the fees of the fulfillment storage and Amazon fees, then we wanna make sure that we enter in the cost of goods sold. So this is our landed cost. And with your own manufacturer, you obviously just do the total purchase order divided by the units, and that's your cost per unit. Where right here, I'm just going to estimate. I go to Alibaba, I search for the product travel neck pillow, and you can get it anywhere from three to four bucks. So we'll say their landed cost, we'll come back over here, is $4.50. So every time I sell one unit, my net profit margin is 35%, which is honestly fantastic. And then if we go in and we type in 50,000 sales, they're profiting $385,000 every single month. Now, you still might be a little confused with Amazon FBA fees and asking yourself, well, how do I calculate it for my own business? Do I have to go in and manually use the Amazon revenue calculator every single month or every single day to know my true profit margin? Do I really have to do that? That seems so tedious. And the answer is no. There's an amazing software tool that you guys can sign up for two months completely free. And then after that, it's only 15 bucks a month. So basically the same price as Netflix. And you guys can know your profit margins every single day, every single minute, every single week, every single month, and every single year. So what you're going to do is you're going to go to the link down below. It's called seller board. And as you can see right here, you guys can click this link, try for free for two months, sign up, no credit cards required, and you're going to see how amazing this tool is. And I'm gonna break it down for you. Now, diving into the seller board dashboard, this is what it looks like. And this is how you're going to know your profit every second of the day without having to manually calculate it yourself. So right here, you can see today's profit. You can see yesterday, you can go in and do a custom date range. But what's so important is to know your bottom line. So many sellers, they don't calculate certain things. And then at the end of the month, they're like, where did my money go? I don't know where the money went. And right here, it's all calculated and accounted for because it's done for you. So you link your account and it literally pulls in your advertising costs. This is one thing that new sellers forget to calculate is how much they spent on PPC. They're like, well, where did my money go? But they forgot that they had their PPC campaigns running and they weren't monitoring it and it was sucking their profit. So right here, you know every single day, okay, do I need to spend more? Do I need to spend less? How can I be more profitable? It'll show your estimated payout. It'll show your gross and net profit and much more and it will literally break down all of the fees that I just showed you guys with a click of a few buttons. So it's all done for you. It integrates into your seller account. You grant it access and it pulls all of the data so you can have access to all of the profit. One thing to note is you have to go to the products tab over here and you have to enter in the cost of goods sold. And what this is gonna do is it's going to allow seller board to tell you your actual bottom line, what your profit margin is. So you come right here and you can enter in, okay, my landing cost is 75 cents or my landing cost is $10. And then right here, there's cost of good type. You can either have it constant. So it's just a constant, hey, my landing cost for the entire year is $10. And if you just want to kind of do an estimate, $10, that's great. And if you're a real data junkie, then you want to calculate your profit by the penny. So what you can do is you can do it by periodic batch. As Amazon sellers, sometimes your cost of goods are going to fluctuate depending on shipping costs, depending on if the US dollar is stronger than the yen or vice versa. You could be getting inventory for $10. Then the next order, you might be getting it for eight. Then the next order, you might 
might be getting it for 11. It just might fluctuate. And then what you can do is you can go in from this date to this date and say my inventory cost was this and seller board will be able to calculate what your actual profit is every single month. And another amazing feature inside seller board is their PPC optimization and automation tool. Most softwares charge hundreds of dollars for this feature and this is included in your plan that you get for the price of Netflix. So come over here, go to the PPC tab and again it pulls all of your campaigns from your seller account and you go to this automation status, you click on edit and then from there you can turn it on and what it will do is it will go in and adjust your bids according to your target A cost. So if your target A cost is 30%, it'll go in and either increase the bid or decrease it accordingly. You don't have to do it. You can do a keyword automation so that if you get no sales after 10 clicks, it'll move a bad performing search term to negative. It literally optimizes your campaigns for you. And another thing that I love about Sellerboard is their inventory planner. As new Amazon sellers, one of the biggest mistakes you can make is running out of stock. Every day you're out of stock, you're losing rank and you're losing potential sales, which means you're losing potential money in your pocket. So what you're gonna do is you come to inventory planner and what this is going to do is it's going to tell you how many days of stock you have left and when you need to reorder. And what you can do is you can actually go in and adjust the product settings and adjust your manufacturing lead time, whether you use a prep center or a 3PL, how many days does it take to ship to FBA or from your manufacturer to Amazon. And it will tell you literally when you need to reorder so you don't run out of stock. Now, coming back to the topic of Amazon FBA fees and profit, I can't stress enough how important it is to know how much money you are making every single day, every single week, every single month, every single year. And if you don't have tools like Sellerboard to calculate, you're going to be lost and you're not gonna know where your money is going. So right here, they have a PL statement where they break down your profit and literally have all the item lines broken down for you right here month by month. And what you're gonna wanna do as well is add other expenses that you have inside your business. So if you, if you eat out, if you have software, tools, if you have bookkeeping expenses, if you have shipping expenses outside of Amazon, you're going to want to come over here to the expense tab and add those in. And that will be the way that you know your true profit margin every single day, every single week, and every single month. This is how to use Sellerboard. It's an incredible tool. Go get your two month free trial down below. I use Sellerboard now on both of my accounts. I absolutely love it. I love Sellerboard. Highly recommend it. Let me know what you guys thought in the comments down below and we'll see you in the next video. Yeah.